Well, we know the holidays can be especially challenging for some families, but the Dallas Children's Advocacy Center is making sure that thousands of kids across DFW have a chance to have gifts under the tree this year. So we are joined with a special guest this morning, Irish Birch. She is the president and CEO of the Dallas Children's Advocacy Center. And you're here to not only talk about the purpose of DCAC, but also what y'all are doing this holiday season to really make it a joyful season for kiddos that have been through some hardships. So let's first, if, if folks aren't familiar at home, what's the purpose of what y'all do in the community? Yes, our purpose is to serve the most severely abused children. We want to improve the lives of all child abuse victims in Dallas County and ensure that they have all the healing services that they need. And I mean, this is a tough job. I mean, y'all are dealing with some really tough situations and, and meeting children exactly where they're at. So how do y'all meet those needs emotionally, physically, spiritually for those kiddos? Yes. Yeah, so we provide a collaborative approach. We want to make sure that we ensure that we wrap our arms around these children from the very onset of this situation. We see children that have been sexually abused, physically abused, and are also witnesses to homicide. So the wow. goal is to make sure that we investigate these these case, cases with our partners and ensure that we then make sure that they're prosecuted and also provide the healing service, the family support, court support, as well as the therapeutic trauma-informed services mm -hmm. that all of the family members might need. What I love about what y'all do in DFW, I mean, y'all are not just meeting these kiddos one time. Y'all are following them as they go through this journey because as we know with abuse and being a witness to those types of crimes and traumas, I mean, that's something that sticks with them and y'all are along for that journey. Exactly, we wanna make sure that when we come into their lives that we're able to help them to understand that this was a situation that happened to them, but we're gonna provide them with every and empower them with every tool that they need in order to have that resilient life. Mm -hmm. Children are resilient. They just need the help in order to ensure that they have the support and everything they need in order to be able to get to the other side of it. And we do talk about the holidays a lot and we talk about all the joy that can yes. surround the holidays, but going through something like abuse or trauma, I mean, it can be hard to find that moment of positivity. So how are y'all partnering with these kiddos to make sure that there is something to celebrate this holiday season? Well, it is a great day for DCAC. Today is the beginning of our holiday of hope. When you have a family that's gone through a trauma like they do, the clients that we see, the last thing that you want them to be worried about is how they're gonna celebrate the holidays. Yeah. So our holiday of Hope program starts today and runs through December 23rd. This is the program where we're able to provide toys, family time, everything that these children need in order to make sure that they can celebrate the holidays with no barriers. Wow. We ensure that we take not take care of not of only the child that we're seeing, but every single child in that household. They're going to receive three to four age appropriate toys. They're wow. going to receive pajamas. They're going to receive um, stuffed animals, uh -huh. games for the family. And we want to make sure that they have that family time. Yeah. So we're doing everything we can to ensure that they don't have to worry about anything during the holiday season. And that is such a burden lifted off of the parents' shoulders or the guardian's shoulders. I mean, that really is meeting those families yes. exactly with what they need. And then to also include the siblings and the rest of the family uh, that really speaks to the impact that y'all are having throughout North Texas. Uh, let's specifically talk about how viewers might be able to get involved in that program and the programs you'll offer throughout the year. So the thing that we need the most right now, everyone wants to buy for the littles, yeah. but really the clients that we see the most is a 14 year old teenage girl. So oh. right now what we need, we need those things that the teenage girls, teenage boys would love to have. The hair tools, the makeup, yeah. the uh, headphones, all of anything that you think a teenage female or young man would need. You can do it a couple ways. You can visit our Hol Holiday of Hope website in order to see the list of things that we you can purchase purchase and purchase those things through Amazon, or you can also make a, a donation. $200 will cover everything that we provide for a family. Wow, incredible opportunities for North Texans to buy in to what the Dallas Children's Advocacy Group, Advocacy Group is doing. Uh, Irish, thank you for sharing y'all's mission and y'all's purpose. I mean, it really is incredible to see the ripple effects y'all are having, and I know y'all will continue to have, especially during this holiday season. So thank will. you for sharing it with us.